give me a confession and I'll sign it right away. You, 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 you killed them? With my bare hands. What, why? Why'd you do it? Hostility. Come on, my, my personal life doesn't have anything to do with this. Believe me, Mr. Uh... Copperman. Copper. You know, look, you be careful now, because I'm very sensitive on certain subjects. Well, uh... Well, naturally, I, I wouldn't bring it up if it, if it didn't uh, bear on the case, but uh, you're a midget. Lots of people are midgets. Uh, but the, the very few witnesses we have claim that he was of normal... Uh... What, what I mean to say is he was taller than you. You see how I fooled him? I'm a master of disguise. Uh, <coughs> have we... Uh, did, did you talk to me several times on the telephone? Imitate Barry Fitzgerald. Go on. Uh, sure and Begora. Uh, Faith and Begora, it'll be all right, son, if you just come to confession regular. That wasn't very no, good. No, wait, wait. Uh, I can do W.C. Fields. I went to Philadelphia once. It was closed. It's terrific, huh? Mr. Copperman, I just don't believe that uh, you're the strangler. You bigot. You're a bigot. Just a minute. You're prejudiced against midgets. That's not true. Yeah, you believe me in a minute if I wasn't a midget. Mr. Copperman. You got any friends that are midgets? No, I don't. Would, would, but would that, you, but would that you like your sister to marry a midget? I don't have a sister. Ah! That's a bigot answer if I ever heard one. All right, Mr. Copperman. 